Hi guys, uh, today I'm going to give you a quick demo how you can use iPod between two servers to check the interconnection speed. So for example, we are taking a server in DigitalOcean hosted in Singapore server and one in Linear which is hosted in Singapore server as well. So both are located in Singapore but they are in different location or maybe they are in same um, data center, I don't know. But uh, this is the basic thing or basically this is how it's done. So, what happens is it just works in two different ways. Uh, one acts as a server and one acts as a source. So uh, let's start. So uh, I'm going to act, okay, before that one, I will just show you it's using, uh, we are using CentOS 6.8, sorry. And uh, Uh, we are using Centro 6.8 and Centro 6.9. So uh, I perf uh, and to install you can just do uh, yum install I perf. Uh, since I've already installed both of them, so there shouldn't be anything to install. But basically that's how it's done. So let's uh, act as a source. So basically what it does is like it's it's listening to port number 5001 uh, with TCP window size of 84.3 kilobytes. So we're going to use Linode server. Mm, okay, before that one. Let's know the IP address, okay. Sorry. Okay, so now let's listen. I perf server. I perf client. What's the host destination? IP 128.199.160.233. Okay. Hmm. I think uh, I forgot to install iperf there. Okay. So I perf client one twenty eight one nine nine one sixty two three three. So as you can see, both servers are now connected. Now it will actually check the speed. So like they are just doing some testing. So as you can see, the transfer uh, that they made was 1.23 gigabytes of data and the bandwidth was one gigabits per second. That's the speed that they are getting. And one more thing what you can do is, you can use the specific port. Okay, let's say you got a use firewall and you don't have that, um, Option to use and default ports. What you can do is you can use a default or you can use any specific port to actually listen to iperf. So iperf, let's say server, but uh, open port, let's say 10,001. So it will be listening to port number 10,001. So before doing that one, like I've done before, let's find out the Hmm, I just need to know the IP address, so let's uh, put no 1001, a perf client, 172.104.50.139, and what's the port that we'll be sending in, 10001, uh, okay. So now they are connected to each other. Okay. Okay, as you can see, the transfer has completed. But uh, since we aren't using the default uh, I, uh, port, so we are getting a variable, variable uh, speed. So let's try with default one.
Sorry, sorry, I forgot to put one thing there. What the hell is happening? Okay. Mm. Okay, perf uh, client to one seventy two dot one oh four dot fifty to one thirty nine. Okay, now these both servers are now connected to each other. Now they are just testing the speed. Uh, okay, so as you can see, uh, when we use the default ports, it's showing like 2.11 gigabits speed, bits per second. So that's that's very, very massive speed. So this is the basic thing, basic way to actually try how you want to use it. So there are other ways to actually try IPERF. That basically it's using TCP window. You can even use UDP for that one. It's very simple. What you gotta do is so let's just open the UDP port. That's it. And um, the same source hmm. One seventy two dot one oh four dot fifty dot one thirty nine. Sorry, I forgot to put the port as TCP. Mm, sorry, UDP. I'm so sorry again. Uh, client, we should be acting as a client. Okay, now both of these are now connected to each other. Now let's see how much speed they get in UDP. I reckon they're gonna get a bit slower. See, um, this is the way to actually test it. Um, that's it, guys. So, this is the way to actually test uh, the interconnection speed between two host two devices. And you can even check this between your two internal networks. And uh, this is one of the quickest way to actually find if they are if you are facing any issues in the servers. That's all for now, guys. Thank you.